Well, <laughs> you see, people tend to complicate human evolution. It's actually very simple. This is where we all came from. Now, fast forward a billion years, then the first animals to develop a backbone were fish. Then, over the course of billions of years, do see today that it is an indisputable fact that we share a common ancestor with them. Thanks. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you think you're doing? Uh, Can I help you with something? You're right. I'm, I'm sorry. I apologize. I, I shouldn't have tried to barge in like that. Um, my, my name is Matt O'Donnell. I, I used to live here when I was a kid. OK. And? Um, this will go to sound weird, but do you mind letting me in just for a second? I, I'm looking for someone. I'm the only one in here. But I'm, I'm looking for some. I'm looking for something. I'm looking for something. It's something I lost when I was a, a kid. Please. All right, but just for one minute. I told you the story about how Charlie Parker became Charlie Parker, right? Joe Jones threw a symbol at his head. Exactly. Parker's a young kid, pretty good on the sax. He gets up to play at a cutting session and screws it all up. Jones almost decapitates him for it. <laughs> they laugh him off the stage. That night, he cries himself to sleep. What does he do the next morning? He practices and he practices and he practices with one goal in mind, never to be laughed at again. So the next year, he goes back to the Reno, gets up on that stage and plays the absolute best solo the world has ever heard. Now, what if Jones had told him, Charlie, it's all right. It's OK. Good job. End of story. No bird. Now, that is an absolute tragedy. I'll tell you, man. There are no two words in the English language more harmful than good job. I know what you do. I'm not your problem. Your problem is the power of Christ. It is not up to you what happens to us. It is not his decision. Nothing is. Yes, sir. This means that we'll have to go into overdrive to meet this deadline. We have till Thursday morning or we'll have to cover the freight cost. I didn't go to bed for weeks. I, I asked God, how could he let this happen? I mean, Stacy didn't deserve this. And my boys sure didn't deserve to have their mother snatched from them like that. They're five and eight years old, for heaven's sake. I want to emphasize that demons are not the towers of strength that movies make them out to be. In Juarez, I saw demon-possessed persons crumble under the rebuke of a child.